That's quite a climb up those steps. Might be better from slightly lower down. A laundry here. The helmet of a knight, there's a shield. I've come to a small town just over the border into the Mercia region. It's called Abania. And I've seen some pictures from here. It looks like there's some interesting, you know, quite pretty looking features to have a look at. And of course the photograph. And of course we'll be having a wander around and see if there's anything else I can find. I hope you'll enjoy the video. If you do and you're new here, don't forget to hit subscribe before you go. Features that I'd seen, pictures of this place, these painted steps that lead up. We've got eyes, waterfalls, palm trees, I'm not quite sure, all sorts of stuff. It's got to be worth taking a, a shot or two looking up here. So I'm going to get the camera out, do some shots from the bottom here, and then I think we'll go up to the top in a little while and have a look. There's a big statue up there that I've also seen pictures of. So a nice wide angle shot looking straight up there there's people walking around but if I take three or four shots as they're moving I've got the option to blend them out if I want to don't want to get too low down with those eyes quite a climb up those steps they're pretty steep very nice all painted all the way up it's one of the features here yeah okay there's a few chips on that because obviously people walk on them but it's still really nice lots of different features there's a spaceman down there some kind of lizard or something at the top here palm trees the waterfall really nice and then when we get up to the top there's a big statue up here of well Jesus Christ that's got to be worth a photo, hasn't it? church down there got a blue dome got a clock tower with like a like a very open belfry it looks like it's kind of a raw iron sort of uh, almost dome shaped belfry you can see the bell through now, I'm not sure this is the ideal angle to shoot it at but on the other hand it might be the only angle to get this kind of view so I'm thinking shooting this with a telephoto lens kind of looking down onto the church just try and find the best angle. There's limited options. Oh, you can hear the church bell ringing now. But uh, yeah, it's got to be worth a go. Unfortunately, there's a really ugly looking bit of building directly behind it in the distance. Looks like it's a, a very modern building, which kind of ruins the shot a little bit. Might be better from slightly lower down. So I'm going to go down the stairs and see if there's a, a better view slightly lower down.
little bit lower down looks better. Get the mountains in the background. come down there's a, a laundry here uh, where people uh, can come and wash their clothes uh, not, a, not a laundrette with washing machines this is with with water and pools now I, I don't want to film any of the people that are here in fact I've just spoken to to one lady who prefers not to be in the pictures or the videos and I completely understand that so uh, I'll, I'll just do some shots where I avoid having anybody in the frame um, and try and do a quick bit of video without anybody in it as well uh, so hopefully I can manage that. <laughs> difficult filming in in towns some beautiful detail on this building here it's lovely kind of uh, I don't know what it is it's uh, like a coat of arms or something I don't know there's like a the helmet of a knight there's a shield there's spears there's all sorts it's got to be worth a couple of shots maybe a slightly wider one to fit in a bit more of the surrounding scene uh, and then maybe a, a closer in shot uh, vertical just to pick out the, the really detailed part. So we'll have a go at that. Jesus, with just the top of the coloured steps. That's not the cleanest of view, there's a cable running across, but I'm thinking if I shoot it with a uh, telephoto lens, maybe, maybe a little bit of cropping in, there's blue sky behind and a bit of white cloud kind of framing the statue, so it might work. A little bit of a crop, that might work. Let's crop out the top and the bottom to remove where the cables are going across. That might look Thank you. 
Today has definitely been a bit more travel photography rather than art photography, but I hope you've enjoyed it anyway. Thank you very much for watching, and until the next video, bye.